Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of New Vegas. All right, when we left off, we were heading towards the guard named Oris, I think that was his name, to investigate his uh, practices on how he manages to get repeat business because it seems a little suspicious. Uh, we're looking up on this for the Kings, which, come to find out, there's a Kings gang member right next to him. So, Oris! If you need to cross Freeside, no one will keep you safer than I will. Really? Well, why do I need a bodyguard crossing Freeside? Just look around. People here are as like to stab you as say hello. That is, if I weren't at your side. Fair enough. I mean, he does look the part with the metal armor and everything. I think that's reinforced metal armor, isn't it? I think. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, how much for your services? 200 caps gets you my watchful eye for a trip to the south gate. Ah, uh, that's twice what everyone else is charging. Hey, you want the best? You have to pay for it. <laughs> Fuck you. All right, okay, I'll hire you. Done and done. I want to All mention right. a few things up front. In order to ensure your safety, I need you to follow my instructions to the letter. Okay. We'll be heading down the main street here the whole way down. No detours. You go off sightseeing, and I go off to find another customer. I'll keep a brisk Jeez. pace. Okay. Try not to fall behind. Now let's head Rick. out. Alrighty. Seems very strict about things. And uh, I was hoping that... What? Hey, you're the one who's been going around helping people around wow, here, Wow, right? okay. The king says to keep up the good work. He said to give you this. You don't think this doesn't look a little suspicious? Holy shit, forced impacts, never mind. <laughs> to your left here is the old Mormon fort. Uh -huh. roughed up, the followers there will patch you right up. Not that I ever need their services. Uh huh. Up ahead on the next block is where the Hashtag humble brag. Don't let them scare you. They don't outnumber you five to one. Complete. Okay, fair enough. But yeah, it seems a little suspicious that he demands to the letter. Uh, <laughs> uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Following him to the letter on his instructions, and uh, two hundred caps seems a little outlandish. While I was really try and get at least some of the caps that the king gave me for the costs <laughs> and trying to keep them in my own pocket but apparently that's not gonna happen ah well well I'll just continue on then whatever we're gonna do oh there he is all right I'm trying to figure out what your gun he has on his right hip is that a hunting revolver? yeah you haven't seen Freeside till you've been to the Wrangler really okay well, I mean, I've been there a million times, so I guess I've seen Freeside enough. Plenty. Oh. Hey, slow down. I don't like the look of some of those men ahead. Let's take a different way around. Yeah, if you say so. To be fair, they don't look like they're menacing in any way. I mean, I could take them right now. Okay, I guess. If you say so. Guess you're gonna have to go around then. I'll pull out my gun. And I pull out my gun! And why are you running? Why are you running ahead of me? One, two, three. There's four people here. Huh? Okay. Nothing to worry about. If you had hired one of those other hacks, you'd be up to your ass in low life right about now. Really? You only fired three shots and there are four guys here. Uh, noticed that, did you? Yeah. I keenly aimed one of the shots through some soft tissue of one of them to hit the man behind him. That is pure bullshit. Because if it, if it was soft tissue, the guy would still be running. You just faked this whole thing to drum up repeat business. That's an interesting theory you've got there. I'd suggest you keep it to yourself. Let's get moving. Or <laughs> I could make it to the king's right now unless you give me all your money I ought to take my chances and kill you right here but you may be right oh yeah here I take am. this I could kill don't you think this myself, is over though really I'll have that money back out of your hide if I have to oh yeah huh oh yeah <laughs> I could just shoot him in the ass right now but now now I'm gonna let this play out right up to the south gate oh here we are I trust you'll keep your mouth shut about the topic we were just discussing, or else. Uh-huh. Or I could just 
shoot you, you right now. Doing? Oh, I, I'm just saying, I could just kill you right now. Be over with it. Yeah, it's all get, get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Huh? Get out of here. Asshole. I'm sorry, that was just too fun. <laughs> uh, I am a dick. Anyway, I assume those guys there were all of that. And I actually could probably go over to the guys who are still here. And uh, here's another way you could check it and call him out on it. When, uh, you know, you get to that point, uh, you can talk to the Freeside Thugs because it appear they appear dead, a victim of your recent fight. Examine the body closely, which we have enough medicine for. A quick study of the body reveals that the thug is still alive and merely pretending to be dead. He set that whole thing up. Those bullets were blanks. Either that or he made sure to shoot them in strategic spots that would not actually hit any of them. Just to play it up. But, you know, that just proves he's a hack. So let's go straight to the kings with this information, huh? Oh, put the gun away now. There's no need to have it out. Man. <laughs> it is fun just calling people out on their bullshit. Tell you what. Yeah, that's why this is one of my favorite missions. <laughs> Alrighty. King School of Impersonation. Alright, I'm gonna... Oh, jeez. <laughs> Knocked over my soda. Ah, jeez. Give me a second. Oh, boy. That was very dumb of me. <laughs> I, I didn't have my hand raised enough like I usually do. And, uh, ended up knocking over my Verners. That was my bad. That squeaky chair, I know. I'm just trying to get myself reset for recording. Okay, onward we go to the king, who is apparently not here anymore. So I assume he must be upstairs. The showdown between the NCR and the Legion is coming soon. Believe you me. You don't need to tell me. I'm already well aware. I've been seeing how everything goes. All right, well, how do I get upstairs? There we are. Sometimes it's just a maze of trying to find my way up the stairs to the spot I need to go. Okay, I apparently have to go through several checkpoints of kings to be able to get to where I'm going. Uh, geez, why are they just standing there? Okay, well, am I uh, am I interrupting something? Apparently not, because she's just standing there. Okay. Um. Hey. What do you have for me? Well, uh, Horace is a fraud. <laughs> Absolutely. He fakes attacks on his clients and then plays the hero. So that's how it happens. Uh -huh. Okay, then. I'll have some guys pull him off the street when no one's looking. That'd be good. You've shown me something. So maybe you can help me with a matter that's a little more important. Really? A lot of folks around these parts who've been here a while resent the sheer number of people that have come into the area since the Strip was built. In turn, the newcomers, most of whom come from the NCR, have gotten ornery from being resented. Sometimes things get violent. Yeah, this is one of those occasions. Recently, yeah. a few friends of mine were attacked, and I want you to find out who did it. Really? Words come that they just woke up over at the old Mormon fort just north of here. Head on over, see if they remember anything. Alrighty, I will head over there right away. Good, I like that enthusiasm. I try. Return when you have some information we can use. Will do. All right, but <laughs> excuse me, pardon me. <laughs> Uh, let's get out of here quickly. Oh, boy. That was not what I expected to walk in on, but okay. At least it wasn't anything too, you know, not YouTube friendly. <laughs> Where is the stairs? There they are. Okay. Like I said, it's a maze sometimes if you don't know exactly where you're going, and there's really not that many landmarks to be able to tell where you're going. So, yeah. There we go. Get out of here. Whoops, that's the wrong way. That's the way I wanted to go. Oopsie doodle. I'm stupid. <laughs> Personal space meaning anything to you, guy? Buddy, I was not even that really that close to you. Shush your face. Alright. Let's uh get out of here <laughs> before I get into arguments with more people. <sighs> So, we have to head to the old Mormon fort and figure out what the hell happened to, uh, 
some of the locals here. We've got there we go. We're not even allowed to sell people. Only at Nick and you probably should not uh, mention that sort of thing, honestly, now that I think about it. But, you know, <laughs> might drum up some really, really bad business if you get my meaning. All right. This time I didn't knock my soda over. Yay! Ah, burners. Up oh, there's Jacob Hall. Looks and like the Legion and NCR are getting ready for a fight. I hope that it doesn't end badly for us. Well, I mean, hopefully not. You still sound like you're high on shit. All right, here's the people, I assume. Hey there. What is it? Can't you see I want to be left alone with my friend here? Oh, uh, the king asked me to look into your attack. Oh, yeah, that's different then. How okay. can I help? I'll do anything to get the bastards that did this. Awesome. So, that was an easy in right there. Uh, do you remember anything about the people who attacked you? They were big guys. Young, too. No old uh, geezers like me. Uh, Hell, okay. none of them looked even half my age. I was mostly okay. face down in the dirt, begging for my life when it happened, so I only got a quick look at them. So, kiddos about my age. Gotcha. Uh, what can you tell me about the attack? Well, it happened at night, around 11. We'd mm -hmm. recently made some caps off a bit of scrap we found and wanted to invest it wisely. All right. As we were leaving the Wrangler, <clears throat> we must have taken a wrong turn and ended up in the squatter side of town. That's From investing nowhere, it wisely. These big guys show up and start barking questions at us, wanted to know if we were locals. The kid uh -huh. there is about as proud as a local around here gets. All right. We started yelling back at him. Then all hell broke loose. Uh -huh. Kid got the worst of it, sad to say. Well, considering he probably more or less started it, that makes sense. Uh, I have to get going. I hope you find the bastards that did this. If you mm -hmm. want, try asking my friend Wayne over there about him. He saw more than I did. All right, will do. Wayne, Wayne. it's okay. The king sent him. All righty. That true? Did the king really send you? Absolutely. And anything you can tell me about what happened might help. I don't really know what else I can add. There were a bunch of guys, better dressed than most freesiders, I guess. That help? A little bit, yeah, because most freesiders are dressed in rags and, well, what you're wearing, which is just above rags. So, yeah, a little bit helps, thanks. Sorry I couldn't help more, especially since you're being so nice. Yeah. Hey, wait, I just remembered something. I might have heard one of the guys that attacked us call another by name. Really? We had just about had it when one of them said, Hey, Lou, we gotta go. At least I think he said Lou. It might have been something else. Now that I think of it, he said Lou something. Something with a T. Tenant, that's what he called him. Lieutenant. He probably said Lieutenant Wayne. Yeah. The boy means well, but he's dumb as a mutant sometimes. <laughs> Fair enough. But, uh, yeah, that's a callback, A. And, uh, B, that is, uh, really troubling because that insinuates that it's a, uh, couple of NCR soldiers that started this whole fight in the first place. So, uh, let's just hope it wasn't something like that because, uh, then that would really look bad to the king, I'm sure. But, I guess we have to go to them first. I assume, or maybe not. I'm not entirely remembering how this quest goes. Yeah, I have to go straight to the king. And then I can talk to the NCR after I talk to the king to try and get both sides of the story. I think. I'm not entirely sure on that one. If it can be bought, it like I said, it's been a while. <laughs> the early game stuff, I can remember like that because I've ran through it so many times. But late game stuff is where my memory gets kind of fuzzy. Because I haven't completed, you know, some save files, mainly because the game has screwed up a couple times with bugs and whatnot. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's that, uh, wonderful Bethesda perk, or the more stuff you throw in, the more bugs occasionally happen. And the more you try to fix it, the more it gets worse. There we go. Up we go. And I think the... No, it was not this way. It was this way. Yeah, it was this way. <laughs> Looks like Gamora's under new management. I wonder what happened. Uh, I shot a couple of people in the face. So, yeah, it's all me. Okay, here we are. And Groupie's still here. <laughs> or at least I think that's... Yeah, that's Groupie. Alrighty. King. Have you found anything out? Or were you just here to chat? Uh... 
not the latter. Uh, the local men were attacked by soldiers. One of the men was identified by rank. Bunch of soldier boys, huh? Uh, yep. They usually don't come around these parts since their big base is on the other side of the strip. Yep. If they're coming over here now, it's got to be for a reason. I didn't want to believe the rumors that they're looking to take over Vegas. But now, yep. if something big is going down, I'm sure rumors of it will have spread. Most likely. Ask around, particularly in the squatter areas where the NCR folk hang. Uh -huh. You might also mosey on over to the Mormon fort and chat Julie Farkas up. The followers tend to be in the know about these things. Mm. Just don't ask her what to do about it. She'll probably ask you to hug someone or something. <laughs> Fair enough. Well, uh, I, I want to avoid trying to hug someone if I can avoid that. So. <laughs> well, I, I would actually prefer to do that over, you know, shooting them in the face. But, you know. Uh, around here, that tends to not be a viable option. I think the, uh, yeah, the stairs were over here. There we go. I gotta use the, uh, guys who were just standing around as a marker to figure out where I'm supposed to go, because at this point, they've all been staying in the same spots, more or less. This is a back door. It is a back door. It requires a key, though. A key that I don't have. So, uh... Alrighty, let's go this way. And out the door. Yes. Wee. All right. We're pretty famous Personal with Freeside now. From again, you don't need to. You don't need to tell me that. I wasn't even that close to. You. I'm trying to figure out what my stats are with Freeside. Oh, we're light. Good. We're not quite at a, uh, you know, idolized point yet, but we're close. All right. We can talk to Julie Farkas to see what she knows. And then, uh, we'll go on to one of the NCR places. Which I don't know where there is any. But apparently it's through here. Not even to and people. over Only there, maybe. Hmm. Alrighty. There's like three different markers. Well, let's go to the Mormon Fort and talk to Julie first. Before we do anything. Maybe it'll eliminate one of those markers and point us in a proper direction. Maybe. Maybe. All right, where's Juliet? Really? She's still in there? Did no one move <laughs> in the last few hours? Jesus. All right, up we go. Oh, there's Julie. I sincerely hope the NCR are getting supplies in place to defend against an attack, because it looks like the Legion has plans for the dam again. Yep, uh, I'm gonna back out of this because I need to do this. Turn the light on. There we go. And, uh, needed to talk to her hey, about the Garrett. good to see you. Yeah, good to see you too. Uh, Garrett should be sending over their supplies shortly. I'm honestly pleasantly surprised they would help us out. But I can see the Garrett's aren't doing this out of the goodness of their hearts. Not well, entirely, Well, it no. looks like you've earned yourself a discount on supplies now that we'll be fully covered. This supply deal will aid our work immensely. Nice. Well, uh, that... Unmarked quest is now completed. I had apparently hadn't completed it, and I had just learned about that that I hadn't completed it. But uh, yeah, uh, do you know anything about NCR soldiers here in Freeside? Only a little. A friend of mine, Major Elizabeth Kieran, has been handing out supplies to the poor a little west of here. Mm. What about it? Uh, the King thinks the, those troops have been attacking the locals. I know something's got them riled up, but I've been too busy with other matters to really look into it. If you're right. looking into the matter, talk to Elizabeth. She's in charge of the operations here in Freeside, though she won't open up to you right away. All right. If Elizabeth holds out on you, tell her that I sent you. She should be a little more forthcoming if you mention my name. All right, Was so there I'll use that as a secondary measure, about? should nothing else work. Um, that should be about it. Thank you. Thank you for that information. It is actually very useful. All right, now let's get out of here. And now people should be moving, because uh, if she started walking towards the door, that means that everyone's officially woken up, bright-eyed, and bushy-tailed, or radiation-tailed, one of those. <laughs> They're glowing, is what the joke is trying to be. Uh, Alright, let's go over to wherever she is. That's a new marker, so I assume that's where the, uh, the, the Major Elizabeth, I think her name was. 
Well, I mean, hopefully. If not, you know, then fuck you guys. Uh, let's go talk to this person over here, because if they're a marker that I can talk to, I might as well. Um, huh. Head to one of the squatter camps in Freeside. Oh, okay. Ask around the squatter camp. It uh, looks like the Legion and NCR are getting ready for a fight. I hope that doesn't end badly for us. Well, hopefully not. So, this, uh, missionary, okay? You look like a person in need of a good meal. You wouldn't happen to be an NCR citizen, would you? Uh, technically not, no. Um, I really don't have time for this. In that case, don't mind me. Carry on. Alrighty. Well, <laughs> fair enough. It seems like I could just outright lie to him and say I am, but I'd rather not. I'd rather try and, uh, figure out from Elizabeth. Or Major Elizabeth. Rather, I should really throw the rank in there, because she earned that shit. <laughs> uh, I really should find out from her what's going on. Because if this, uh, if I already found some stuff out from Julie, it's probably better if I do that anyway. And uh, from the sound of it, it'll probably make sense what he said in just a moment. Uh, there. That's the door, I think. I assume. Uh, nope. That's the door to Freeside, so that is not correct. It's a little further on this way, I guess. Oh, Jesus Christ. Why did I go this way? I'm an idiot. That's what. Uh, I guess down further this way. Uh, yeah, there it is. Alright, well, they have a couple people outside. Guess I'll need to talk to one of them. Hello. Hey Hold on. What's the password? The password? I'm here to see Major Kieran on urgent business. Please let me through. If you're here to see the Major, then I suppose it's alright. Head on through. Alrighty. I only remembered her first name, not the uh, last name, so. <laughs> Oops. Okay. Not like that matters much. I hope this helps. Oh, that's, that's nice. Okay. Welcome. There's food and water here for any citizen of the NCR. Please, have some. I didn't need some, but thank you. Are you with the NCR military? Yes. I'm a major in the Supply Corps, which is where this food and water comes from. All right. Uh, thanks for the food. You're quite welcome. If you meet anyone who needs food or water in the area, please tell them about this place. All righty. Yes? Uh, is there something else needed you to needed? talk to her about, do you serve food to locals as well? No, I'm afraid we don't. Don't you have a friend you wanted to bring in? Uh, why don't you serve locals? That's not really a pleasant topic of conversation. Let's just say we have our reasons. Uh, Julie Farkas told me to ask. She said it was important. You know Julie? Mm -hmm. Not everyone in the NCR sees eye to eye with the followers. But they're okay in my book, mostly because of her. If you uh -huh. really want to know, we sent an envoy to the king. Offering to coordinate the relief effort. And the king refused? In a manner of speaking. Our envoy was brutally beaten and only barely survived. What? My superiors ordered the relief mission scrapped. I managed to get clearance to carry out the mission anyway, but with greatly reduced support. Now there's not enough supplies to go around, even if I wanted to serve the rest of Freeside, which I don't. That's all in the past now. I should get back to work. Okay. Say hi to Julie for me. Will do. But, uh, inform the king that the NCR previously sent an envoy to discuss distributing supplies to Freeside. That doesn't sound like the king, though. Hello. That doesn't sound like his M.O. That really doesn't sound like his M.O. One would think he would have absolutely jumped on that opportunity. Someone else footing the bill for helping his people? Absolutely. That doesn't make sense. We'll have to follow this for damn sure. But uh, we're a little over time right now, so I think I'm going to end this episode here for right now. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the game for playing together and how I managed to spill my soda while I was recording. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games and investigating weird circumstances involving the NCR trying to help Freeside for you.